This is a clone of the 1977 Science of Cambridge Mark 14, which was a kind of a training computer. It used an SCMP chip from National, which is quite hard to get hold of these days. You can get them, but they're very expensive. Um, so this one uses Karen Orton's emulation, which runs in a PIC. Uh, it's not an emulation of the overall machine. It's This chip is an emulation of the SCAMP chip. Everything else is Mark 14. All the code it runs is the original 1977 code. So if I step through memory, on the seven segment display we've got the address and the data at that address. If I step through memory, what you've seen is the actual code from 1977 um, that runs the keyboard and the display of the Mark 14. Um, we can modify memory if we go uh, F80. thing. Um, and then if we examine that memory, if we go to F80, we see what we've just put in, 1122334. Um, to run a program, you put the start address, which is uh, F20, and at that address I've already entered uh, this message program, which is actually from the Science of Cambridge manual, the uh, original book that it came with. So this is kind of Apart from the actual message itself, the code is, is word for word from the manual. And then, having put in the address, we just press go. And there's your moving message. So there you go, a clone of the Sinclair Science of Cambridge Mark 14. And um, using the uh, PIC emulation of SCMP. And uh, the PCB is done by Phil. Uh, his his uh, name is Philopat on the Vintage Computers Forum. A very nice PCB he did for it. Uh, but the, um, uh, the heart of the thing is the emulation of the SCMP chip, which is absolutely brilliant. It really is. There you go. Sinclair, Science of Cambridge, Mark 14.